Human trafficking. Experts say it's happening in every state, including right here in Ohio. And so far this this year in our state, there have been 310 human trafficking cases started after more than a thousand people have called the National Human Trafficking Hotline. Only right here on News 5, Tracy Carlis shows us how an agency designed to help those victims is now in the global spotlight. Ohio is consistently ranked in the top 10 states with the highest rates of human trafficking. The National Human Trafficking Hotline says right now, Ohio stands at number five. I'm very passionate about it. That passion about building up human trafficking victims who have been torn down is shining the global spotlight on the Renee Jones Empowerment Center. Her passion to help started with outreach in the middle of the night decades ago. We started going to the high traffic areas doing street outreach in the middle of the night, Friday night, Saturday, 3, 4 o'clock in the morning. And that is when we encountered not only women being sold, but being trafficked. Jones saw the problem and opened a center in a small storefront here on West 65th Street 20 years ago. When I started, no one was talking about human trafficking. For me to say that was so, like, people couldn't believe it. When you heard human trafficking, you thought about other countries, not here. But it happens here every day in every community. She's now in a bigger and better space designed to help victims and survivors in a way that not many other agencies offer. Her organization offers a lot of services all in one place. We have individual counseling, group counseling, support groups, life skills, horse therapy, art therapy. We have a plant club. We're looking forward to having her come in. And this woman? You're going to hear from survivors. Is taking her mission from her little local center to the world through a podcast called Project Red Cord Chronicles. And people are listening. We've had people from Germany. We've had people from uh, uh, United Airmen's, uh, Dubai. We've had people from Mexico, from um, India. But that's not all. We have a global initiative, and we are working right now with the Council of International Programs. We've been doing a speaker series where we have all these countries come together globally through technology, through Zoom. We have a speaker's conference. Through the years, thousands of women have turned their lives around with the help of the center and Jones. Women like Annette Mango, who went from a human trafficking victim to a survivor. She did turn my life around. She didn't only help, she did do it. Now the hope is to reach victims around the globe. This little place can make a difference around the world. In Cleveland, Tracy Carlos, News 5. And the latest episode of that podcast dropped on Friday. We have posted a link in Tracy's story on News5Cleveland.com.